Hey YouTube, this is Dean making another vid. If you like my content, please consider hitting the like button. Also, please consider subscribing as it is very much appreciated. I honestly didn't realise how much quartzite I've got on hand. I just pulled it out of the bucket that I've got over there. Um, and there's still probably 20 centimetres of sort of that size in the bottom of that bucket. But this is the big stuff that I've got here sitting in the bucket. That's the quartzite that I have on hand. That pile there. I don't know how many kilos it is. Ranges from this sort of stuff to this stuff to chunks like that. Um, yeah, I didn't realise how much I... It's sitting in a bucket. I, I, I bought a plastic wine barrel, half wine barrel. And, yeah, it's... um Because I, I, I was having troubles. I've, I've been using the same sort of stuff that... Same quartzite for a couple of weeks now. And it was all getting pretty, pretty banged up. But I also have some pretty substantial chunks there that I'm going to have to break up because they're too big to use even though they've got good edges on a lot of them but yeah that's only young that was only two boulders broken up so yeah I, I didn't realize how much I've got on hand here that, like that one there that's some that's good quartzite there because that's solid bits that stuff there it's really good quartzite because it um is just sharing sparks and it shatters into these sharp such sharp edges but down here I've got these big bits here um, yeah, I'm not to shatter my glass there I noticed down the bottom here, oh yeah, got that rock there. That's a couple of kilos just by itself. And that could be spoiled up into several pieces, but yeah, just a massive chunk of quartzite. And that, that'd have to weigh three kilos by itself. But it's really hard to break that piece up because it's a solid bit of quartzite but I didn't realize how much I really had on hand here and that's only two bits that I've, I've actually been actually had but that's the pile there I've got bits and small bits what I, I wanted to pull it all out so that I um, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get put some more of the um, better bits back into my working rocks again so that I can use them again because I'm going to piss the other ones off because they were all starting to get blunt again and I'll probably break them up but I also want to get all these small bits out because I'm probably um I might I might discard all them because these smaller bits here I've got in bags I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet um they're good for um kits and that but I'm, I don't really put them into kits um as such they're just working bits that's a better bit well that's just you can really drive it drive really good bits off that that's a good piece um smaller shards like that's a, a really good piece um some of them are, are really good but I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. But I just wanted to show you. Uh, yeah, I've got so much of this quartzite. I don't know what I'm going to do with it all. There's just so much of it here. And um, my son said he, I, th I think he said he, there's another four or five boulders down there that would produce, well, this is two boulders. So if I've got four more, I'd probably have four times as much as this again. So I've got that much quartzite here. I don't know what to do with it all. Honestly.
but yeah, it certainly produces sparks with some of my best steel. Well, that's my the one I made. But as you can see, that's um, that's showering sparks. But that one there, if you tap it with a hammer, that would break up quite well. But anyway, that's a good yeah. Just an indication of how much quartzite I've got on hand. But some of this smaller stuff here, that would certainly fit into, into kits. But I don't like quartzite for kits, mainly because um, it just shatters so easy and chips out so easy. Because, um, yeah, it just doesn't, it's not as good as flint. And I, I prefer flint in my kits because, yeah, well, oh, that, that one would be all right, I suppose. You know, because, um, oh, let's, yeah, see, it's, once you get off onto that, that's a bit softer there, you could almost, you can almost see, oh, I broke it up just for hitting with the steel. So that's actually not, not the, um, that's the, um, softer bit. But I am getting definitely good, good sparks off it. Some of it would be all right. Yeah, some of that smaller stuff's all right. For kits, I suppose. Yeah, that. I oh know that's all right. I thought the softer, softer bit. Normally, you can break break the softer bits off just by tapping it with your steel. That 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 bit there. Yeah. You know, you you're getting good sparks off that. That's certainly very viable. And that that nice flat piece. You know, fit in that'd fit in a kit, all right. But I, I might not put the um, this stuff, the smaller stuff, in. But I, I want to rotate it out because all that small stuff seemed to migrate down to the bottom, and I, I was having trouble the other day with with um, some of this quartzite was a bit blunt. But I'll go through and put some sharper bits back in there. So when I'm doing my demonstrations, I can have good good quality of quartzite in there although I might try and put some sharper bits of this bigger stuff because I, I do like this that sort of size for my demonstration because that, that's a perfect rock it's got a nice platform you can you know certainly lay some char cloth down there or whatever just on the, on that there for a good platform you know so that 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 to me is about the perfect size for rocks as far as I'm concerned and you can certainly drive sparks off almost any edge on there, you know, like every edge is almost viable, that's a bit soft there, but um, you know, every other edge is very viable. Anyway, just wanted to show you the, um, <laughs> look at that beast, that's, that, that is a magnificent piece of quartzite, that, that, yeah, you know, but that, yeah, as I said, probably three kilos there two kilos three kilos anyway rattled on for long enough about my quartzite pretty proud of it actually because it was just found in the backyard and that's why um yeah just showing it off because I'd, I'd walked past it so many times and um just discarded it and hadn't hadn't even thought about using it as as viable stone but um yeah i've, I've found it now and um I'm just so happy I've got it because um yeah it's just um such a good stone to just to dry sparks from because I'm getting really good sparks from from it and it's so useful I don't have to ever buy I I will never have to buy stone again I've got this so much of this stuff on hand I'm it, it's it's um yeah it'd be silly if I ever ever had to buy stone again anyway thanks for watching.